Vindia is asking, I'm unclear about what value add is here. How is Finial adding value to industrial buildings? Uh, she she specifically says unoccupied buildings. Yeah, great question. So um, what we consider the value add opportunities are really deals that have not, uh, they don't have long-term leases in place, right? So there may be a vacant building that we're acquiring at a very attractive price uh, that, you know, once stabilized is worth substantially more than we've acquired it for, plus whatever leasing expenses we had to get it there. And that's really the way that we're creating value. Um, and that second bucket is this short-term stable with value add. And so that's a deal that may have uh, a couple of years left on its lease term, but a lot of leases are far below market today. Uh, industrial rents have grown at a pretty a, you know, significant rate uh, in the last two decades. And so when you get to older leases um, that may have previously been a five-year lease, it's generally under market by maybe 20 to 25% relative to today's market rates. And so when that lease expires, there's an opportunity to either negotiate with that tenant on a renewal to get them to mark to market that opportunity or go lease it to someone else that's willing to pay a market rate. And it's really through that strategy or that portion of the strategy um, that we're creating value and growing the NOI of the portfolio.